ericmothethmother.com. Let's take a look at the long term monthly charts for GS, Goldman Sachs. And so far, we are seeing, let's say, about a 9 to 10% drop in early trading for February 2018. Could it be that is because of negative divergence on the long term monthly chart plus rejection at the 69.1 level? So, in the past, whenever we've seen these two things happen, We've seen GS pull back for a multi-month move to the downside. As an example of this, we can see an improvement on a month-to-month -month basis. We have negative divergence. At the same time, we have 69.1 rejection. And it is uniform activity rejection. And because of that, we get a multi-month move lower. The next time we do something similar to that is here where we have price improvement to new highs on a monthly basis. And then we have again negative divergence. And we also have RSI 69.1 uniform activity rejection which leads to this multi-month drop. So could it be that right now we are seeing the same type of situation playing out where we have an improvement on a monthly closing basis. We have again negative divergence and we also have RSI 69.1 uniform activity rejection which is suggesting that we have a situation where stock is primed to go lower over a period of many months. We shall see. Eric Mwadith, mother com. As always, good luck, peace, and blessings. E-A-C-S.